Hey Eater Pass family, welcome back to our channel. Today we will be showing you how to take the seeds out of sorrel and how to prepare sorrel drink. So this is actually a traditional Jamaica drink that's made during the holiday times in the in December. So first thing there is a seed inside the soil and you just take it like this. Well, this is how I do it. This is how it looks. So I'm just gonna do this over and over. There we go. And guys, the seeds, they can actually last for an entire year until December again but you have to know how to store them but yeah they get kind of dry after after a while and you can plant them before December and they'll be ready to harvest right when December starts or before yeah in November as well so what we will be doing is once we take the seeds out we'll put them in the sun to dry and then we'll keep them until it's time to plant and then when Christmas time comes again we'll harvest yes this one is so tiny so that's this is what the that's what the seeds look like guys aren't they cute kinda cute huh and they kinda have a furry look yeah or a hairy look Okay, so I'm just gonna do the rest. So guys, the thing with sorrel, you can't have them for too long. Like once you've harvested, you have to pick them, as we're doing now. We call it pick picking the sorrels, and then you have to make the juice, or they'll they'll start to rot. Yeah, in a very f a little bit, like yeah, in a, a few, few days. days or so. So guys, what you can do though, I think you can put it on your freezer. Yes, you can store it. Once you've picked them, you can put it in a poly bag or something or a container and store it in your freezer until you're ready to do the preparation. Yeah, so you can use a plastic bag or a um, plastic container, like a glad bag or something, and yeah. you can put it on your refrigerator. But it's good to just go right into the preparation when it's fresh yes but if you have too much you can definitely store some for later and i think you can have them in the freezer for a very long very time. long time yeah maybe like a year or so okay guys so we're practically finished with picking all the sorrel so this is what it looks like guys and now we're gonna wash the sorrel and make the drink Okay, so we are going to wash our sorrel and make sure you wash your sorrel thoroughly. Okay guys, so now I'm just going to add my sorrel to some of the sorrel to this pot. This is good. So I have some cinnamon leaves and stick that I'll be adding. Washed cinnamon leaves, by the way, and whole cloves. And now I'll have to crush my ginger to add. I'm just gonna crush my ginger, guys. So that all the flavor can come out when I put it in the sorrel. Okay, so 
add in the ginger and it's time to add the boiling water so the boiling water is now to be added guys it's very hot so you have to be careful Okay, so what I'm gonna do now guys is to cover the pot and we're gonna let it steam for about 12 hours so 12 hours guys we're gonna leave it to steam and then we'll show you the rest okay it's our past family it's been over 12 hours and this is what it looks like the color is so pretty it's like very bright and red so i'm just gonna strain this and do the rest of what needs to be done so i got the strainer and oh look at that color guys yummy yummy okay it smells so good guys it's, it has a sweet smell because of the cinnamon leaves and the cloves as well as the sorrel go that's what it looks like usually people add liquor and yeah liquor <laughs> and sugar but we'll be adding only sugar to ours So that's the amount that I'm adding. I'm just gonna mix it and then taste it because I don't really want a lot of sugar in it. So you can add red label wine or white rum if you'd like. Yeah, or both. So that's the Jamaican rum that you'll add. Mm -hmm. And it gives it it gives it a nice flavor, guys. But honestly, I just don't want any liquor right now. So just making it into a, you know a drink, regular juice drink. just gonna add one more full quart of sugar guys and I'm gonna mix it again and then we're gonna bottle, bottle up this drink see it looks like wine guys the color is very vibrant it looks pretty good Okay guys, so the sorrel is now sweet. It's not too sweet. It's sweetened. It's perfect. And this is the way I like it. And I'm just going to bottle up the, the sorrel now to put on my refrigerator. So this is what it looks like, guys. Tasty. So this is what it looks at, like guys, I'm going to put it on my fridge, let it cool and I'm going to have it with my Sunday dinner. <laughs> 